both e-news, latest news and developments, and price predictions and technical analysis at the end of the video. We'll do it on the ETH and BSC side of things. But today we're going to talk about both e-news, new partnerships, and their ambitious goals to get the attention of Elon Musk. Welcome back. Moneybags Rico here, bringing you financial awareness to a crypto space that is changing on the hour, every hour. With that being said out the way, make sure you guys smash the like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and make sure that bell notification is lit. For those who have not noticed, BOAT can also be traded on 29 CEXs. So that is some big news right there. If you guys have not noticed that, that's a huge accomplishment for the BOAT army. So shout out to them for doing that. We got the Inu is getting ready to vault. So this is big news going on right here. And we have this partnership with the Elon Goat token. Elon Goat is very happy to begin the vote Inu sculpture that the vote Inu official is contributing to the Elon Goat tokens monument dedicated to Elon Musk and crypto as a whole. Elon is a savage deserving of this. Stay tuned for more. There is much more coming soon. So there's some big news coming soon. I suggest and I hope that the vote army can come over here and vote this up. Let's get this over a thousand likes, over a thousand retweets because there's a lot of marketing going into this and go ahead and, you know, leave some bolted comments down in this video below. So like that, the YouTube algorithm can push this video out. Moving forward, we got Crypto Boss right here, a huge, um, following right here of 140,000 followers. Um, I'm calling on the Bolt Army once again. Let's come over here and get this well over a thousand likes and get this over a thousand retweets and leave tons of comments of why you're you're bolted on Bolt because you know this is that cross pollination right there where people can see what's going on through what's going on on his page. So that's something that we can take advantage of right there. Now talking about that partnership that Crypto Boss was bullish about, also going over to what he said, vote another CEX listing is here, potential buy bit listing. I just increased my bag right here. Of course, none of this is financial advice. Do your own due diligence, but there are some big things going on. It seems like behind the scenes. So we got the um, Vote Inu, Vote Listing Announcement, Hot News, Vote Army, Get Ready, Vote Inu Official. On the 25th, which is today, this Monday, Vote Inu on the Ethereum blockchain will be listed on TextBit. So that is huge right there. So shout out to the Vote Army. Shout out to um, TextBit as well. Now going over to the Elon, Elon Goat token. This is something that we can take advantage of. Like I said, get this up. Get the comments up in here. Do some retweets and do some cross-pollination. Let them know that Vote Army is here and we're bolted all the time. Checking out the NFTs, something to keep an eye on. We got good bolted evening laser eyes. This NFT looks epic. The background, the way it sits, I mean, it it, it really catches you. Like, it, it kind of jumps off the page. Even the laser eyes coming off, like, it's... I like how it's how it's set up, Um, the dimensions on it. It looks really good. So, moving forward, if you guys want to know more about it, check this page out right here. I have 7,795 followers. And they talk about the 10,000 3D Bolted Dragons sailing around the world to find their club. So if you guys want to join this club, if you're part of the Bolted Army, let's come over here. Make sure you guys give this a lot of likes, a lot of retweets. Let's get the word out and about, okay? Let's go ahead and share that as much as we can and retweet that. Because, like I said, that's cross-pollination on marketing right now. So right now on the 15-minute chart, we can see that we're holding the support on the 86.96. Moving up to the 30 minute chart, we can see that we're about to flip this dot, right? And moving up to the hour chart, we can see the same thing, right? That we're marching, we're holding on. We see that first candle. We see down on the MACD that we're, um, the selling pressure has gone away. So that means that we're still trading within this channel between this 8696 and going to erase the zero. We can see that, you know, we had trouble breaking that point right there. We had some breakouts, but the markets are kind of sketchy right now. It's just how it is right now. But layering this chart, you can count that if you're a range trading, of course, not financial advice on the 30 minute chart, we can see that this candle is about to touch this dot, usually meaning that it'll flip the dot over and, you know, lining it up with the MACD. We can see the blue line about to cross the red one and that the candles are losing selling pressure. Why? Because they're getting smaller and also they lost um, the darkness in color. So they're a light red now. Going over to the 15 minute chart, we can see that we held this support, right? And if we go back and look in the past, this is a support that we're familiar with and we held on to and we're not letting it go no more. So we're trading within this channel. We'll see what happens when we march back up to this erase to zero. Moving over to the BNB side of things, we can see an area that's that I've marked up that could be where what you would want to see, right? This would be that that breakout making a higher low right here to go test going towards these higher lows. This area that we're in right now is the area that we've been in before. So we see the support right here by this green triangle before we went to all time highs. And we see that same area of support right now, which is that 1092. We see an area of resistance. Before we move on to that, we also notice that this support 
later on became a resistance and now it's a support so we want to hold on to the support it's crucial to hold on to it so then we don't have to fight to make that back uh where it turns into a resistance so let's hold on to this and push past this 1241 making a higher low above here would be interesting where we could break out after that so leave some comments down below let me know what you guys want to see more on the channel about volt i know we got volti chain coming out very soon so leave some comments down below make sure you guys like and subscribe to the channel and continue to come back and experience the abundance of money with me until next time you guys know what it is later